Hi Donna, so what you're going to do is after you sign into your Gmail account, look up here at the top and you're going to click on, your should say drive, it might say docs, uh, but probably should say drive, so you're going to click on that. And once you click on that, you should see the NWLA YHEC bylaw, so you're going to click on that. And once it loads up, you'll be able to see over on the right side one other viewer. Click that little drop down triangle, and there's a chat box here where we can actually have a chat. Okay, so let me show you how to do the um, how to do the comments. So you can pick any place along here that uh, you might want to put a comment in. And let's say we you thought that there was something wrong with this line of text, and you would simply highlight it and go to insert comment. And that will place a comment right there, as well as, of course, highlight the text. And you could uh, add your comments here. This is a test comment. All right, and so you hit comment. Now, notice it puts it in the right bar over here, right area. And also, if you look up here in the upper right, you can always click on comments and see all of the actual comments and click to go to them. You can also reply to comments. I'm going to fix this. All right, and so that gives us a comment thread. You can also mark a comment as resolved, okay, which means that it got changed and you consider it resolved. And you can always bring those back up again by hitting comments. You can review all the commented text. You can also tell it to uh, show the comment, or you can add another to open. And notice that, that once I did that one, it reopened that comment and put it right back on those texts. So it's a, it's a really cool way to collaborate on a document. And one last thing, if you click on comments up here, you can also go to notification settings. And you can tell it to enable email notifications and then check off how you want to uh, see these notifications. That way you don't have to constantly go back to a document and see what has been commented on. Now, of course, editing a document is uh, very simple. You just click in here and begin editing. And even if there are anywhere in the document, and if there are multiple users in here, everybody will see it being edited in real time. Now, one other thing we can do is manage sharing. So if we go up here and click on share, you'll see who the owner of the document is, who has the ability to edit it. We could also add um, somebody, let's see, NWLA. And we could give them view only rights, which means that they can just simply view the document and not change anything. And that might be good for members uh, at large, but we don't necessarily want them to have edit rights to the document, but they can view it in real time as the document's being produced. And we can also give people not only view rights, but comment rights. They wouldn't be able to edit the document, but they could make a comment such as a suggestion for a change. So this is a very, very powerful way to collaborate on a document and be able to get something done uh, and at least get the raw text of it down, but we can get fairly detailed in the formatting for, we need, uh, for what we need. And it allows us to bring people to the document, to the single document, instead of trying to distribute all these copies and who has which version and, and all that sort of thing. This is a much, much better way to do it.